Hi, this is Mike from Blue Road Home Music with a short tutorial on latency problems when you're integrating Reason into Logic. I've done a couple of videos uh, with a workflow where you can integrate Reason into Logic. In other words, where you can control everything in Reason from the Logic sequencer. And you can see those videos uh, with the links if you're interested in that. Uh, however, some people that have followed those videos um, have contacted me uh, saying they have latency issues. Um, and, you know, latency issues can be very annoying. In other words, you're hitting your keyboard and the sound sounds slightly late, so it's kind of impossible to play in time. And that is an issue that you will run into sometimes when you're integrating Reason into Logic. Uh, it mostly depends on your computer. Um, but there is one setting in Logic, there's a rewire setting that you can change, which I think will probably fix any latency issues you may be having, old computer or new, about 90% of the time. So let me just show you that really quick. So you want to go ahead and open Logic, and you want to go into the preferences for Logic, and make sure that Reason is not open at this point, because you just want to set preferences for Logic here. So if you go into Preferences and you go to Audio, um, you'll notice on the bottom here there's a Rewire Behavior. That's the setting you want to mess with. There's only two settings, okay? It defaults to Playback Mode, less CPU load. So most of the time, whenever you look at this setting in Logic, it's always going to be on this, this setting. And this is where like older computers might have kind of a problem with latency. It really depends on your computer. Some newer ones probably don't, but this is always the default setting. And if you are having latency issues, this would be the place to look first, um, aside from your other uh, settings and logic, which is your input output buffer size. But if you notice here, so this is playback mode. This is the default. I have actually set mine to live mode, live mode, rewire and internal. I think this is a better setting when you are using rewire, in other words, using rewire to use reason in logic when you're connecting the two programs. So um, if you are having latency issues, just change it, change your rewire behavior here in logic to live mode, rewire, and internal. And I guarantee you 90% of the time that's gonna fix most of your problems. Now I probably should have mentioned that in, in the past videos that I did, but again, it's it's different for everybody. It depends on your computer, so you're going to have to kind of fool around with it and see what works, but uh, for the most part, when I've told people to do that, uh, it, it takes care of the problem right away. Happened on my computer. I had to change that setting myself, and uh, right now, Logic and Reason are working just fine together. I don't have any latency or any problems like that. So anyway, I hope this helps you all. Uh, again, if uh, you like this uh, video, please like it, please subscribe, and go ahead and leave comments if you're still having problems. Maybe it can still help you out because there may be other settings, but that is a good one to start with. So enjoy making music, and this is Mike signing off.